Good morning. I hope you are all doing your morning routines. One of the key ones that I need to talk about is meditation. Now, once you meditate, after that you're obviously going to feel a sense of calm. You're going to feel much more relaxed and you're gonna be able to focus better. Now, now, why is that? It's because you spent a certain amount of time in the present moment, in the now, because that's all there is anyway, is the now. Time, you know, uh, from my opinion um, and, and perspective, time is just a chain of consecutive nows. So you've only got the now. When you wake up in the morning, like what, what I've found is when I've got some stresses going on in my life um, and I've got some things that I'm thinking about and um, some things that I haven't handled yet, then as soon as I wake up in the morning, um, if, if I don't go and do my morning routine and meditate, I begin to start indulging in that distraction of thought about you know, the stresses or the things that I haven't handled yet. And if you don't meditate, if you don't do something with your morning routine, then you're going to end up, that's, that's just gonna end up, um, it's basically gonna put you, put you in a downward spiral because all these stresses that, I'm like, that your mind is now indulging in are just building up and they're just putting layer on top of layer on top of layer. And then if you don't do anything throughout the day, don't do any sort of meditation or relaxation, um, and then this sort of happens for consecutive days in a row, then what's gonna happen? Things are gonna build up more and more and more. So the reason that we meditate is to try and get ourselves into that present moment for a certain amount of time. But what are we doing in between the times that we're meditating? So meditation is one, but now you need to focus on I mean, if you meditate for 20 to 30 minutes a day, what are you doing for the other 23 hours? You know, some of it's sleep and the other time you're working and doing, I mean, doing whatever else. But that's the time that we need to really be conscious of, are we indulging in these distractional thoughts? Are we indulging in distractions? And what I've found is every time that I want to let my mind wander and you know, and start to focus and indulge in something that I haven't handled yet, but yet I can't do it until a later date anyway. So there's no point bothering um, yet sort of worrying about it now. Um, is every time I go and do that, I'm really trying to find a distraction. That's, that's all I'm really doing. And you'll end up, when you want to distract yourself and you want to indulge yourself in a random thought or a stress, then you'll find yourself reaching for things. And what I've found is if you prevent yourself from reaching for these distractions, whether it's an indulge, um, whether you're indulging in a thought or whether you're going to reach for something, what you're reaching for might be, it might be social media, right? It might be the TV remote, it might be chocolate cake, it might be soft drink, it might be alcohol or whatever else but it's that act of reaching for something to distract you from the now. So as soon as you prevent yourself from reaching for it, now you're coming back to you and you're back into the present moment. And what you'll find is once you've stopped reaching for it and the longer you're back in that present moment, you're probably going to want to distract yourself again. And you're gonna get that, um, that next sort of feeling of, oh, I need to do something or, I need to check my emails, I need to, oh, there's a text message, I need to check that or, or whatever. And every time that happens, so just do it again. Prevent yourself from reaching for it. Prevent yourself from indulging in that thought and just come back to the present moment. So this is how in between your meditation throughout your daily life, you can spend more time in that present moment. You don't just have to wait until meditation or relaxation, whatever you prefer to do get back into that present moment. And if you've got distractions and things that, um, I mean, that are bugging you, if you can't do it today, and it has to be done at a later date, well, there's no point thinking about it. Just come back to what's happening now, because that's all there is. So the time that you have now is for now. The energy that you have for now is for now. 
the mental space, the focus and mental clarity you have for now is for now. I hope this has helped you out. Um, you'll find that when you wake up first thing in the morning, this is when it starts. This is when it starts. So you need to get on top of it straight away. This is another benefit to the morning routine, like waking up and hydrating first up, doing a breathing exercise, going and getting active, um, and doing your meditation. And so you're getting it before things start to layer up. And once you do that, um, as time goes on, you'll find your quality of life is much better. Cool. Any questions, comment below. Um, if you just want to send me a DM, that's fine. Um, if you want to keep it uh, confidential, no worries at all. So yeah, eat, think, and live clean. Have an awesome day.